What do we have over here? By the great gods, I've been I asleep. Watched. I was just counting my sheep when I dozed off. Please find my strange sheep. How many sheep are missing? Well, they were gonna be slaughtered anyway. I say we waste the wandering mutton. But if we find and return them, we'll have a died in the wool follower. Well, the saintly one made a joke. Okay, so just to make this easier on myself. Many thanks, higher power. Keep them coming, please. Okay, now there's one here. Many thanks, higher power. Keep them coming, please. Okay, they're fishing for food, which is good. I just want to activate all scrolls while I can. Hi, man. Neat stone circle, huh? It's a bummer that some are missing. Sounds like we can help there. What? Help this deluded sack of burnt out neurons? The stones have to play a scale. That's what we need. Tap a stone to hear its note. This sounds pretty inharmonious to me. Are you sure you've found the right stones? I ain't finished yet, mate. Calm down. Still, I still need stone. I'm missing two. I can zoom right in to just see the sheep. Many thanks, higher power. Keep them coming, please. Any more scrolls for us to take a gander at? I don't think so. I guess we can continue it on. Holy one! There's a huge creature in the valley beyond! We're all terrified! This must be the creature that Siebel spoke of. Let's investigate. Bear. Look at the size of that! Ah, okay. We're dead. We're all dead. What is it? Where's it from? It doesn't seem to be aggressive, though. If it is, we're all dead. Even the spirits, dead. You top us. Can you hear that? This giant is communicating. It's telepathic. You have a creature. Bring him to me. No way. He'll eat him. But this giant looks friendly. Let's bring our creature over with the leash. So... Every time I've ever played this, the creature here has been the lion. And I just wondered if it was because of the fan patch, but now I'm wondering, does the creature that you meet here depend on the creature you pick at the start? So if you pick the ape, you'll run into the bear. If you pick the tiger, you'll run into the lion, etc. Is that how it works? So that's a neat thing I've just discovered, you know, two decades later. Please use the leash to bring your creature to me. I wonder what the creature is for the cow, if that's the case. Hmm. Please, use the leash to bring your creature to me. 
I guess the creatures don't get as big as the mountains as I originally said, but they get pretty big. I think this is the biggest they can get. This dude is a unit though, go down oh, me. Built like a tank. Please use the leash to bring your creature to me. On his way, mate. I do hope they'll be friends. Oh my god. Another creature? Is it true? Are you real? I've been alone for eons. I thought I would die without ever seeing another god. You're another creature. I once belonged to Nemesis, the most powerful of gods. But his power kept growing, and soon I wasn't bold enough for him. So I was cast out, banished here, and I've been alone ever since. Until now. This being is astonishing, but what a sad tale. In return for your friendship and that of your creature, I will teach you both. You will both learn the ways of the gods. Yeah, that nemesis god sounds pretty friendly. We should go say hello. When you are ready for the first lesson, meet me at the village through this pass. Oh my god, my monkey is so tiny. <laughs> Alright, we're still looking for sheep. Lost sheep. I have to zoom all the way in, as I said, though. There's 20 of them. Wait, no, that was it. Thank you. Looks like you've returned my flock. I can't offer much, but take this with my thanks. We've got some food. Is that it? You offer me lousy food, mortal? Okay. I could try this. Look, I have these wondrous creatures you can choose from. Oh, Jesus. Rhino. You need to bring our creature, boss. Baboon. <laughs> Leopard. That's cool. I don't think I'm going to change it though, I'm sticking with the ape. Oh, I found all the sheep. Uh, I think we've done everything we can in this... Uh... In this village. What are you doing, mate? Mate? What are you doing? What? Okay. Why don't you go eat? Look here. Eat the food, eat the food, eat the food. Rubbing your tummy, rubbing your tummy, eat the food. There we go. 
Don't poop on any houses. I probably should have him rest before we do anything. I'll use that time to look for that last stone. Would it be out of bounds? I seem to recall there being one inside of a house, but I could be mistaken. I could very well... Oh, there it is. Three decoys. Hmm. What are you doing? I don't trust you over here, mate. Don't poop on the house. All right, let's go. Let's go see what the bear wanted. Where is he? Where is the bear at? There he is. This is the Aztec village. I will teach you the first secret here. These people do not yet believe in you as a god. To grow in power. You and your creature can impress them until they believe in you. Look at the village store. The flag shows that they need food. If you give them some, they'll think it's a miracle and will believe in you more. Click on the signpost to find out more about desire flags. This is a food miracle you can cast once. You can pick up such ones and activate them by... Things like this really impress the villagers. If your creature is on the rope leash, he'll learn this miracle as you cast it. Now you try. Tap on the miracle and click the action button on the as. Well done. Now click the action button over the village store. Nice. Good. Not only have you fed them, but now they believe in you more. I have created more food miracles for you to practice with. At the village center, you can see your symbol. When it reaches the stone hand there, the village will believe in you. Holding your hand over it shows how much belief the people have in you. I need sleep. Wake me when the village believes in you, and you are ready to continue your education. One belief needed. And I'm pretty sure that my creature can only learn a limited number of miracles. So... I don't want him to summon food. I figured something like rain's better where he can go around and water the crop fields and stuff because I don't think these miracles give you much food. I could be wrong but with that said it's also a good way of impressing everyone The Aztecs will worship you now Cool You have not investigated many silver reward scrolls leader. Try a few It'll be worth it Oh, you found another sheep. I forgot there was more than five. 
Wait, did I? Wait, did, did, wait, did my monkey just go bring a sheep back? Hell yeah. children are lost. They'll need rescuing. A stranger has been seen putting the children into trances. He has well, them imprisoned up. in a secret place. This stranger is to blame. It's got to be him. But if he should die before we find the children, they could be lost forever. Oh, my babies. <laughs> uh, hold up. Child abduction. Um... We must act. Tiny lives are at stake. Tiny lives? Come on, who cares? Anyway, let's move out! Uh, you know, I've always wanted to say that. Okay, where is this dude at? Prod me. I don't care. I won't believe in you. Alright, come on, creature. Come get him, quick, before he abducts more children. Oh, God. Oh, what the hell? Timmy, come back. Preacher, come on, where are you? Preacher! Get away from me, you big mutt! Prod me! I Go don't get him! Care. I get won't him. believe in you! Go pick him up! Go pick him up! Quick! Get him! Get him! Get him! Help! I'm having a panic attack! Oh, I just attacked. Oh! Ah! Ah, you got me! Let me live! Don't eat me! If you spare me and take me to my cave, I'll release the children. I only wanted a family, but the village women said I was too ugly. Oh, boo-hoo! Let's turn him into a creature snack. But if we take him to the cave, we'll save the little ones. Ah! I'm invulnerable to you. Prod me. I don't care. Wait, I won't wait pick him up, you. pick him up, pick him up, pick him up. Ha! Huh, I'm nowhere near my cave, and you set me free! Get help! I'm having a panic attack! I feel no pain! Go oh, pick him up. Go oh, pick him up. <laughs> yeah, I saw the auto mod, but yeah, you're right. Get away from Prod me! I don't care. I won't believe in you. Damn it. We have to wait for him to come back out. Tie him up, boss! He's getting on my nerves! He's right, and he won't get away when he's leashed to our creature. So we'll have to wait for him to come out, and then we'll send the creature up to grab him. There he is. Fool. Way out, way out. There he is. I wonder if I can circle around him. Get away from me, you big monster! Ah, you've got me again. Hell yeah, I do. If you spare me and go, go, go. Before my creature launches him in the air again. <laughs> All right, let the kids go. Thanks for letting me go. I've released the children. Oh. From now on, I'll be a proper normal villager. 
spreading belief of you and trying to forget how bad I've been. Hey, we did a good thing. Ah. Nice. Another of those cool miracle dispensers. I'm refreshed and ready to start teaching your little creature more. Use the field. Poop. 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 Good boy. We need the poop on the fields. It'll grow better. Faster. Plus it means he's actually going in a good area. Oh my god. For whatever reason, this model just keeps getting slapped. It's super easy. There we go. No, go use the field. Use the field. I feel like I never had that issue when I used the tiger. throw up. Why is he throwing up? Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. I need to rub his belly. I mean, that's all I've been feeding him is grain. I hope it's good for him. Okay, you... Okay, so we save the kids. We're teaching him how to use that, which is good. We'll go join him in a minute. I want to teach him the water... I, I don't know. Am I better off teaching him the food miracle or the water miracle? No, the water miracle because he can... The rain miracle. Because he can water the crops and he can put out fires. So it's like two good uses, whereas the food is just food. But the rain one, you know, you can grow... I'll be honest, it's been a long time, but I'll look for the wood one when I get the chance. Oh, nice! He's already learning it. Nice. Ah. Oh. 
<laughs> Let me check the creature cave, see what it says. The creature cave. The scrolls display different attributes about your creature. Okay, so he can only learn four abilities. This shows the miracles are creature miracles. can cast. Wow, half a creek in time. I know that when I normally play, I normally teach them like offensive moves, but this seems pretty good. He'll be able to do water and healing, which is going to be big. This scroll shows what he's learned to do. Phil is praying with evil. Oh, I should teach him how to use the village store. Yeah, definitely. I'll have to do an evil play for it at some point. Uh, attach him to that. I mean, attach him to the store. No, don't poop on the store. I don't know how to get him to poop in a certain location. Did he poop in one of these houses here? He did. him to that oh hell yeah So. so what does my oh i bet the creature cave would tell me what my creature eats wouldn't it general information such as hey boss you can change or add tattoos to the creature by clicking on yeah, you can give tattoos people killed one who's ten um it doesn't say what kind of food he eats what is the creature this thinking this world shows our creature's state of mind his like said
I was hoping it would tell me what food he likes. Creature to the big guy. I smell combat. Yeah, it's getting close. I always like the creature combat system in this game. It was actually pretty cool. Why do I feel like one of these houses has one of those musical stones inside it? Yeah, the water, the rain miracle is pretty close. He's already casting it, which is good. Where's the beach they set off from? Nemesis creature, he often sent me into battle. I foresee the same for you. First, I will become your size to make things easier. Be prepared to get bruised. Don't worry, in time things will heal. <laughs> the bed looks pretty cool when small. An arena will appear every time there is a fight. You should know that your creature will fight without help from you. What all Firstly, combat? Let's learn to attack. Click on a part of my body using the action button to strike there. A good hit, you can queue up multiple attacks as well. Try queuing up several attacks on me now. That's right, now you must learn to block attacks. Wait, I didn't know Click I could spin the them. On your creature to make him block. What does that do? That's it, a good block there. You'll stop blocking if you do another command. Let us concentrate on the dodge. Click the action button anywhere on the ground to move the creature there. That's it. You have learned well. Let us try some friendly combat to test these skills. Hi, right, close. Get me. I'm too fast. Oh god, he dodged. Ow, he hit me. Oh, that must have hurt. 
Hey, mess him up, mess him up. There we go. Well struck. Oh god, I want to lose this. There we go. Ooh. Oh, that must have hurt. Oh my god, it's over. That was an important lesson, friend. You show great potential, but work on your technique. secret for you, but I warn you, this knowledge is dangerous. But come only when you are ready. What I will tell you is forbidden knowledge, dangerous even to gods. Why don't you try out what you've learned while I sleep? Okay. Let him sleep. I'm still missing one of the stones. Get some food, matey. Actually, you don't know how. Okay, come here. Oh, it's raining. Someone must have one of these singing stones that I need. Yeah, I've fished up a few of them already. I need to teach them how to use it. I'm really trying to find that last singing stone. I'm not entirely sure where it's at. Could be hidden in trees. Be hidden behind a rock. Are there any silver scrolls that I'm missing that I haven't done? Still sheep. Find and return. Good gracious, another sheep. Superb work. Is healing everyone. I'll put it back. 
Put it back, yo. Who does he eat? <laughs> I don't know, I don't think it's green. Yeah, he ate the grain, but he threw up earlier, but I don't know if it was because uh, he needed the bathroom or not. Oh, there's the Pied Piper. <laughs> okay, water the crops. Like that. Yeah. See if he'll do it. There we go. That's good if he's just going to keep watering. Uh, just past that arena, you say. I know there's this scroll to continue on with the story. Oh. Oh. Oh, the troll. Oh, how horrid. I think he's trying to speak. I don't want to teach you what we do. <laughs> me, pig hungry. Me, name Slag. This ogre seems to be guarding something. A reward, perhaps? He's guarding the pass. He's outside our influence, so let's send that creature to fight him. We shouldn't resort to combat with the poor thing. Hmm. He looks hungry. <sighs> I wonder, can I give him food? Where's my creature? He's pretty tired. I'll wait till he's no longer tired. I'll feed him and give him some food to take over. Okay, come with me. Oh, creature. He's got a long way to go. I'm wondering if I can give the ogre some food. Because when I've played this in the past, I've always sent my creature to fight it, but I just wonder, can I just give it food? You shall see. Maybe I can launch food towards it. I don't know. While he's on his way, I'll try launching some. He's eaten that. Is he getting drowsy or is it me? Oh. Okay, so maybe I don't need to.
That big oaf's as no. thick as a rock. He's gone right to sleep. Duh. A beach ball? We went through all that for a lousy beach ball. Hold on. A spell dispenser just appeared near our temple. Oh? Heal miracle increase. What does that mean? Oh, I mean... It's a better healing miracle. So how do I unlearn a miracle? So I already taught him how to heal. But I guess this one would be better. Yeah, he can learn them both, but I mean, I don't want... I've only got four miracle slots from a creature. I don't want two of them taken up by a heal, if that makes sense. Increase. I kind of figured if I could unlearn heal and then teach him this one. Really? Is that how it's used? I mean, is that is that how it works? Disciple breeder. Oops! I just turned that dude into a breeder. <laughs> Disciple breeder. No! 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 Monkey! Stop! Stop! Disciple breeder. No, no, stop turning them into breeders. <laughs> Whoops. Okay. We don't need we don't need more villagers. <laughs> That's pretty funny. So I had no idea. So is that really how it works? Your creature can learn as many skills as uh, they want? Because that is something I never knew. Challenge room. In here, you can get also if Let me look at this. These pedestals hold the miracles your creature is best at. Oh, yeah. Like 20 odd years, I've always assumed you creature could only learn a limited number of miracles. That's funny. 
That changes everything. That changes everything. My grid can learn how to be strong. Increase. Where is he? Learn it, damn it. Light is pretty dang cool. Um, are we missing anything? So, what I'm not sure about is how to complete this scroll. Because I know that if I continue on with the main story, I believe at this point it will move me on to the next island. But I've never completed this quest, because my creature's never grown that big. I don't know how to grow him faster. And I still need to find that last singing stone. Feel like somewhere. Since you can start that one quest early, I assume it's within the influence rather than out of it. You never know. Look, I have these wondrous creatures you can choose from. Is that one way to do it? What's the reward even for completing that scroll in particular? The guy you gotta impress. Another sheep? You found another sheep. This scroll is going to drive me crazy. Does your creature grow if you give it mushrooms? Is it the same miracle though? <laughs> Stop throwing stuff at the orphanage. Likes it. All right, take this beach ball away. Increase.
How can I still be missing this? I feel like I've looked on every part of the island, but I'm just, just be skimming over it somewhere. It also doesn't help that draw distance is kind of funky, so... Like I should give the rest of those mushrooms to the creature, see if I can grow him. Might have to look into that, but I don't want to corrupt my save now, so I can I can make do. Well, that's making him bigger, ever so slightly. So, I wonder if you're meant to just feed him, feed him mushrooms, then go back to that guy. Maybe I'll just give him lots of food, make him fat, maybe that works. Eat up. Sorry. I wish this would stop slapping him. Okay, are there any singing? I'm missing literally one singing stone and I have no idea where it is. Where, where were the creatures? It was around here. Red mushrooms. Oh my god. Probably make him sleep. Get him over here and we'll have him eat all these mushrooms. Any sign of a singing stone? Or a musical stone? very beginning uh that would be this path pretty sure i got that one I'm seeing it unless it's up on the cliff That sheep out. Oh, 
another sheep. Well, I never. This gets better and better. Almost there to the buffet. What a red one does. I feel like the red one will probably make him sick because it looks kind of bad. I mean, it didn't do anything to him, so I don't know, actually. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'll make him sleep soon. I just want him to eat his mushrooms. Yeah, but he might grow if he eats the mushrooms. That's what I want him to. Hey, uh, go back. I'll probably just pass on that scroll to be honest. The reward isn't really necessary. I do want that last last stone. It's gonna drive me crazy. Let me just lock him to the... Purple one do. <laughs> yeah, let's go 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 back to go out of bed, go to sleep, sleep it off. So I'm gonna have to take a good look and try to find this last last uh singing stone. Might see if I can add in a patch that will give me better draw distance. I'm just missing one. Gotta be here somewhere. Where it could be, I do not know. We'll find it. <laughs> 